What's up and what's going on guys, Geek is on the film today. I'm going to be talking about the um, latest episode that came out, episode 6 of uh, Stargirl. Basically, yeah, there's something we need to talk about. Yeah. So, with this episode, spoilers by the way, with this episode, um, this isn't obviously the real act playing Stargirl, the real actor right now is playing Breck Bazinga and this is just taken from I can't remember Legends Legends I can't remember anyway uh, leave it in the comments down below um, basically this episode they've practically in a way wrapped up finding their current modern daytime JSA members, which uh, includes Wildcat, it includes Our Man, it includes Stargirl, Stripe, uh, which is Pat, um, yeah, and stuff like that. But there's obviously those other those missing characters. Of that were a part of the JSA, that was uh, Jay Garrick, uh, those fucking Green Lanterns, Lantern thing, and obviously, basically, what that Lantern did is it like, um, it kind of flashed green when Pat found it in the previous episode, and that's just meaning that the Lantern has uh, recognised its new owner, so expect a Green Lantern at some point down the line coming to the show. Um, whether it be, I don't know, whether it be some form. But there's, I can't remember his name. But it's probably the one that got his, power, got his powers a lot differently. Because I think he got his powers from the Lantern more than the Ring. I'm pretty sure. I cannot remember his name. If you can, comment down below, like I said. Um... But the bigger question is Doctor Fate, Doctor Fate, because there's been a question, there's been questions about him um, when this one character popped up, and I'll show you him now. I'll show you who he is now. So this geezer here, this guy here, the janitor, janitor. Um, so he bumps into um, Doctor Midnight, uh, the current new Doctor Midnight, and says. Um, be careful, there are dragons living in the water. And that's something that... That's the type of thing... Um, type of Doctor Fate thing, I would say. And people are speculating, is this um, Doctor Fate? Is who is, like... People are really going ham on this janitor character. Um, saying, is this person Doctor Fate or not? And obviously... Um, I can't remember how they got, oh, that was it, yeah, a version of Dr. Fate, uh, didn't, like, he was kind of not really with it, in a way, but went, and then he got the uh, power of Nobu, and, uh, which is, if you don't know the power of Nobu, it's, I'll remove my camera for a sec, it's his little helmet, it's his helmet, um, the helmet is called Nobu, and whoever puts it on is basically... With him, with the power of Nobu for all of eternity until the own until until the person dies. I'm pr I'm pretty sure, and yeah, Doctor Fate is like some being, and Nobu is some like like magical high end being, and if this janitor person really is Doctor Fate, then. We have at least one possible JSA member within the high school, and that's good. That is good because we've already got Sportsmaster and Tigress hanging out in there, and I'm pretty sure there's the um, the violin girl, the violin teacher. She's in there as well. So there's like three uh, ISA ISA members in the fucking thing. But there's no JSA members in the school except for Stargirl, Wildcat, and um, Doctor Midnight. But they're like 
they're kids. They can't handle fucking people like them. So, yeah, I'm, if this Janet person really is Dr. Fate, then that's going to make a hell of a things hell of a lot good for Stargirl and the others. Um, I'm a, I'm a assume since uh, the janitor is in there and he ends up becoming Doctor Fate that Stargirl recognizes him more than and and possibly doesn't tell Pat. I don't know because maybe actually no, she will tell Pat because. I'm pretty sure they kind of had an agreement type thing where they um uh they let start she he let start go do her thing, but she, they uh, she needed to train them and Pat knew she won't stop until the uh ISA are gone the Injustice Society of America. So I feel like if. Inju uh, fucking inju I feel like if um, Dr. Fate pops up within this school as the janitor, Stagger will be the first to know and she will tell Pat. She will tell Strike. And so, they will have like a little bit of a debate what they should do. Like, I don't know. They're going to have like some weird shit going on. It's because as soon as Dr. Because... I'd say Dr. Fate is kind of a big character. Um, probably one of the most powerful um, in the JSA. So I think if if Stargirl has a ma magical cosmic staff, then surely Dr. Fate would kind of help. And fucking Dr. Fate and Stargirl would work very well together. That's what I think. And if... Like I said, if this is the janitor is Dr. Fate, I'm going to be gassed as fuck. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this. Smash a like on this video. Subscribe if you're new and turn personal notifications on for more. Also, if you want any more videos, comment down below what you'd want me to react to, review or explain. And I'll shout you out in that video. And by the way, I'm writing a new song. You know what it is. I'm 50-50 at the minute with it. I need to like still write it because like I've not been... I like it, but you've got to be in the proper mindset to do it. Like, write a song and get the beat, put it on, because otherwise it will frustrate you if you're not in the right mindset to do it. So, yeah. If you're doing that type of... want to do that type of thing, there's a little tip for you, be in the right mindset. See you in the next video.